for these students. Yeah, Career choices don't have to be made anytime soon. But events like this aim to help them when the time comes. My mindset really since like I've been really young uh, to, is to be a police officer. And so I know there's stuff over there that really caught my mind with like all the police cars and stuff. So I really like what they have showing us. And the female students at the expo weren't shy about asking questions relating to male dominated careers. Brittany Goins and her classmates from Elizabethtown spoke with a National Guard recruiter. I think women should join it because they should show them people and other people and themselves that they know how to fight too and that they're just not women that just make children and give birth and take care of them. The exhibits offered various opportunities to get hands on. Your back wheels going to be turning. Jaden Klein tried his hand at operating a forklift using a virtual reality headset. Honestly, yeah. at times I didn't even know if like it was real or not because it was it's my first time in VR also, and it was just very trippy. And this massive inflatable allowed students to get familiar with the inner workings of a heart. I thought it was really neat. Like, you like you don't really get to see hearts because, you know, most of the time they, sh they should normally stay within your human body or else that's a bit dangerous. Carrie Grace, WLKY News.